Hello everyone, this is Brady with Lewis Motor Company and today we're taking a look at our 2009 GMC C8500 crane truck. It has an Altec AC 1570R that is a 29,000 pound capacity and a 70 foot reach. The truck itself only has 4,700 original miles, less than 5,000 original miles on this truck. It's got an Isuzu 7.8 liter turbo diesel that starts right up, sounds great. You can hear that now. Very, very, very low mileage on this truck. Those are the correct miles. It's got very low hours. It does have a PTO hour meter inside the cab. We actually bought two of these trucks out of the same company, same fleet. They both have extremely low mileage. Not sure if the other one is this low a mileage, but it is under 10,000 miles on both of these trucks. Uh, we have a 14 foot flatbed it is a wooden deck flatbed you've got dual control stations off the rear you've got a wireless remote is what robert is operating it with right now we've got four hydraulic outriggers and this truck overall inside and out is like brand new it's truly a time capsule for a 2009 to only have 4700 miles that's pretty impressive uh, they must have just bought this truck kind of parked in a parking lot and used it very seldomly uh, but we did do some service work to it, even though the low mileage, it still was sitting. So we did do some low or, uh, excuse me, we did do some mechanical work to it. Not a ton, but we did two new front tires. The drive tires in the rear are all in nice condition. They do show some age, but they are in nice condition with no major dry rod. They have deep tread remaining. So while Robert's doing that, we're going to take a look at the interior here and show you up front. Steer tires are new, they're in great condition. Now we did have this truck sandblasted and painted underneath. Uh, we, I'll show you where we started and where we stopped. So this front part of this frame is all original. This is how the truck was. There's some light surface rust in some areas. Now toward the rear, it kind of got a little pitted and a little bit of surface rust. So we sandblasted and painted and it shows really nice. knew what it would turn out like when we get back to the back portion of the frame I'll show you in depth what it looks like now but we knew it would turn out really good by sandblasting it just had a little bit of flakiness a little bit of peeling but overall it shows really nice now I'll take a look at this, at this interior here now it is just crank windows got a vinyl seat but look at this all the common areas for a Kodiak the door handles in good condition we even still have this window doorknob Driver's seat's in great condition. There's no rips or tears in either of the seats. The floor shows really nice with hardly anywhere showing. The steering wheel, which is impossible to find used, is in great condition with no wear. So this is an accurate mileage truck. 4,768 miles on this truck. That's 4,768 miles. Uh, we do have a check engine light. We will be taking care of that before the sale something uh, we need to look at. PTO hour meter, 736 hours. So this truck has been used very, very seldomly. And overall, you can just feel this interior. It, it is just in great, great condition. The dashboard's in nice condition. Hardly anywhere showing inside. It's in great, great shape. Got our battery charger for our wireless remote down there. So you have an extra battery in case it dies. But this interior shows exceptional. Allison automatic transmission, AM, FM radio, heat, air conditioning. The truck is right. It's in great shape. Everything works. It is an air brake truck, obviously. You do need your commercial license to operate it. You got a 56,000 GVWR, 80,000 GCW, so gross combined. Robert is operating it around. You can see he's all the way off the front of this truck and he's operating this crane. So again, 29,000 pound capacity, 70 foot reach. And it looks like it's all the way out currently. This is a huge boom on this truck. So we've got dual control stations off the back. Say if you didn't want to use your wireless remote it could be done you can operate it from either side of the truck uh, 
Four outriggers are all hydraulic. You've got switches off the back, uh, two sets of switches, one for either side. Uh, Goodyear tires all the way around on the drive tires here. We got, uh, they look to be original. Maybe they aren't, but they're, uh, they got some age on them. Uh, but still, deep tread remaining. No major dry rod and certainly ready to go down the road. So you can kind of see back here, uh, the frame and underside, a little bit of pitting showing from the sandblasting, but it looks so much better. It just had a little bit of scaling, a little bit of surface rust. We knocked that off, painted it up, and painted it in a rust inhibiting black paint. But everything on this truck is in great, great condition. Even the wooden deck, it doesn't even look like anything has ever even been on this deck. You've got something that may have just been sitting on this deck, but the boards are really straight. They're in nice condition. They're not warped. The deck is in great shape on this truck. Everything on this truck is in great, great condition. Now we've got low charts on either side. You can see our control station here. So it can be controlled from either side. Off the back, we have a pinnel hitch with some pole wiring. Got strobe lights, work lights all the way throughout this truck. So night work is gonna be no problem for it. Off this side, again, two more outriggers. So a total of four outriggers. The switches for the outriggers are off the rear here in between these two strobe lights. We got the driver's side here, passenger side here. to get you up into your control station and we do have a load chart now i've got a picture of this in the listing but you can go through there and see your range diagram and your load capacities the chart makes takes all the guesswork out of it got all your controls again this is the same on either side but most people prefer to use that wireless remote anyways because why not so we'll step back, we'll watch Robert operate this thing for a second. But it's right, the boom function's 100%. It's just a great, great truck. Very, very low miles. And it's a pretty fast boom too to operate. Winch goes up and down extremely quick. It's actually, I believe, a two speed. You can see there, I mean, it's a, a fast working truck for sure but this truck shows inside and out like new it really is a nice truck it's a time capsule we sandblasted and painted the underside just because it had some pitting some light surface rust showing uh, but we painted it up and it is showing great in a rust inhibiting black paint underneath you can see down the frame there the cross members are all nice and solid there's no major rust showing on this truck anywhere Again, all your drive tires are matching. They are good years. Uh, they do have a little bit of age to them, but they're in nice condition. Got a hydraulic tank here. And you can see, my goodness, look at that frame. Wow. Shows like a new truck. So that's why we sandblasted it. Had a little bit of flaking, a little scale. Uh, but it turned out really nice. But this truck is truly a time capsule. Again, I think we bought uh, two or three of these at one point. I think it was just two actually. But very low mileage trucks with under 10,000 miles on both of them. They're just really nicely operating trucks. Very low use. Under 1,000 PTO hours on this thing. They spent a ton of money to buy this truck and then didn't even use it, so. Their loss is your reward there. Uh, but again, wireless remote functions as it should. You can see Robert's just kind of hanging out there by himself, operating his crane. Cab's in great shape. Some minor scuffs and scratches here, but overall a very nice one. Got strobe lights throughout. Now you do have a winch lower and raise switch to get it off of your 
motor there, little strap. So that's very nice to have so you don't actually have to go through the process of putting out your outriggers or anything like that. You can just undo it if you want to raise the hood or anything like that. But the truck's in great shape. Very, very low use. For a 2009 to have under 5,000 miles is almost unheard of. Probably one of the lowest mileage trucks that we've ever seen uh, as far as like a 10 year old truck, 10 year plus truck goes. This one's in great shape. It's got a very nice Altec crane, wireless remote, dual control stations, four hydraulic outriggers, tandem axle, 14 foot bed. The Zuzu 7.8 liter Allison automatic transmission, work lights, strobe lights throughout. Truck is right, it's 100%, it's ready to go to work. Literally buy this truck from us and go to work tomorrow. But you can check this truck out for sale on our website, which is lewistrucks.com. That's L-E-W-I-S, trucks with an S dot com. We are Lewis Motor Company. We're located in Clarksville, Maryland, which is just outside of Baltimore, Maryland. If you like this truck, I can ship it to you. Just call me and I'll give you a quote on that. But a great truck, it's turnkey, you saw it operate, everything works on it 100% and it's ready to go to work. Thank you guys for watching.